Thanks. Well, those who live in public housing, they are hoping the boilers will be working this winter. Mayor de Blasio visited a heating plant on the, the Lower East Side, the rehab houses earlier today. Amy Enzi joining us now with more on that and what he said. Hi, Amy. Hi there. On the coldest day of the season, Mayor de Blasio is talking about last winter, which was especially rough for NYCHA residents in all five boroughs, many of whom were freezing in their own apartments, buildings without heat, broken boilers, people without hot water in their apartments. The city now trying to get out in front of this issue before this winter kicks in officially. Take a look at this video taken earlier uh, this morning. Mayor de Blasio and NYCHA officials were touring the Jacob Reese houses here in the Lower East Side in a boiler room and then they announced a new plan. It is a system wide plan but it will focus on buildings with the most heating problems. Those buildings impact 87,000 residents that are feeling the brunt of these broken boilers and uh, other issues that I just mentioned. In these developments, uh, NYCHA will be focusing tremendously and NYCHA is replacing old boilers at 14 developments, which suffered the most last winter. They're adding mobile boilers to areas where they cannot fix the heating plants that need fixing and additional technicians, 50 in total, which will be working around the clock to fix any outages. Uh, Mayor de Blasio and NYCHA officials say that they do not want a repeat of last year because it was just unacceptable. The actions we're talking about today are an important step to getting the heat back on in as many NYCHA developments as possible and making people's lives better. We believe in fairness in this administration. The goal of this term is to become the fairest big city in America. We can't do that if we cannot improve the situation at NYCHA constantly. We believe it is doable. We believe it will take a huge amount of work and we believe it will take real time. It will also take a huge amount of money. NYCHA still needs $31 billion to pay for all the repairs necessary. Mayor de Blasio is saying that without federal and state funding, that can't happen. We're live in the Lower East Side. Amy MC, New York One. Back to you. All right. Always comes down to money, doesn't it? Thanks, Amy. Well, man's best friend.